Drawing our attention back to Dreamweaver, I've decided that I would like to have the animation play back for about five seconds. And I also know, if we look at the Timelines palette, that the default frames per second, here's our frame rate setting for Dreamweaver, plays at 15 frames per second. So if we take the number of frames we currently have and we divide by the frame rate, well, you can see here we've got one image, 15 frames, playing back at 15 frames per second. You do the math, you can see the animation will play back at one second only. What I'd like to do is have the animation play back for up to five seconds. Therefore, based on our calculation, I'm going to actually extend my timeline to 75 frames. To extend the timeline, let's go ahead and make the timeline panel itself longer by dragging from the corners. And to extend the timeline, all we need to do is simply take our ending what's called keyframe. Remember, a keyframe is denoted in Dreamweaver by this white bullet point you see here. And a keyframe is going to represent a significant change in our animation. Take that keyframe and drag, adding the number of frames you wish to add to the timeline. I've now added 75 frames.